Land trusts offer yet another means of protecting agricultural and natural resource lands here in Delaware and elsewhere across the country. According to the Land Trust Alliance, a land trust is a nonprofit organization that, as all or part of its mission, actively works to conserve land by undertaking or assisting in land or conservation easement acquisitions or by its stewardship of such land or easements. Land trusts perform a number of critical tasks and responsibilities related to land preservation efforts here in Delaware. For instance, land trusts accept donated conservation easements from private landowners in exchange for general, federal, and state income tax benefits. Also own and manage conservation lands in fee simple across the state. Land trusts also accept open space easements from developers as mitigation for new construction. In addition, land trusts work with the Delaware Department of Agriculture to acquire purchased agricultural easements and with the Delaware Department of Natural Resources and Environmental Control to acquire new public parkland and natural resource lands. In this respect, Land trusts serve as the eyes and ears for state land acquisition and easement programs by working on the ground with landowners across the state. Lastly, land trusts provide environmental education opportunities to the greater community and local school districts. Land trusts in Delaware have worked to permanently protect more than 48,000 acres in Delaware and are an invaluable resource partnering with other nonprofit organizations and governments to leverage funds for conservation. One such land trust, the Delaware Nature Society, owns or manages more than 2,000 acres on six nature preserves and farms and holds easements on another 480 acres. While they are headquartered in Hocassen in northern Newcastle County, they operate statewide. One of the state's oldest and most prominent land trusts is Delaware Wildlands, headquartered in Odessa in Newcastle County. This organization owns and manages more than 20,000 acres of environmentally sensitive lands across the state and has helped protect another 10,000 additional acres in coordination with the Department of Natural Resources and Environmental Control. The Sussex County Land Trust, based in Rehoboth, has worked to protect more than 5,700 acres in Sussex County. The Land Trust has been particularly adept at leveraging Sussex County open space grants and private funds to provide a match through the Delaware Agricultural Lands Preservation Foundation. Nanticoke River Watershed Conservancy operates out of Seaford in Sussex County and seeks to protect environmentally sensitive lands in the Nanticoke Watershed in Maryland and Delaware. It currently owns and manages 75 acres and holds another 325 acres under easement in Sussex County. While the Brandywine Conservancy is based across the state line in Chads Ford, Pennsylvania, they have protected more than 1,800 acres of farmland and natural resource areas in the Brandywine and White Clay watersheds in northern Newcastle County. They also have a municipal assistance program providing planning services to local governments and landowners in northern Delaware and southern Pennsylvania. And finally, the Delaware chapter of the Nature Conservancy has been very active throughout the state. With offices in both Wilmington and Dover, the Nature Conservancy has protected tens of thousands of acres and has resold much of this land back to the state of Delaware as public parkland. Since 1990, the Delaware Department of Natural Resources and Environmental Control has worked with conservation partners from across the state to leverage federal and state funding sources to protect 34,000 acres of state parkland and acquire easements on an additional 3,000 acres of environmentally sensitive lands. In addition, the Department of Natural Resources and Environmental Control also administers the Delaware Land and Water Trust Fund. This program provides matching state funds to counties and municipalities for the acquisition and development of parks, greenways, and trails. Municipal and county-sponsored projects may receive up to 50% in matching state assistance, while projects in designated park districts may receive up to 75% in state assistance. Thank you.
Thank you.